Hi, I'm Ella. And I'm John. And we both work at Spectra Packaging. Today we're going to be taking a deep dive into the wide topic of plastics, which is inspired by this year's Earth Day theme of people versus plastics. Yeah, so Earth Day is all about taking action to protect our planet and reducing plastic production is a huge part of their mission this year. Um, so they are actually demanding a 60% reduction in the production of all plastics by 2040. Yeah, but it's not just about pointing fingers at plastics. So we've got some goals from Earth Day and some of our thoughts as well here at Spectra Packaging. So let's kick things off. Earth Day's first goal is to promote widespread public awareness of the damage done by plastic to human, animal and all biodiversity's health and demand more research be conducted on its health implications, including the release of any and all information regarding its effects to the public. So at Spectra, we agree that plastic pollution is a growing concern that can impact our health, wildlife and the environment. However, while the negative effects of plastic are evident, it's equally important to recognise the vital role that plastics play in healthcare and food safety. Plastics enable clean water supplies, enhance medical care, mm -hmm. prevent food from spoiling, benefiting our society in numerous ways. Yeah, and did you know that plastics in healthcare actually saves lives? So 6% of global plastic usage actually goes into healthcare. Earth Day's second goal is the rapid phasing out of all single-use plastics by 2030 and achieving this phase-out commitment in the United Nations Treaty on Plastic Pollution in 2024. The phase-out of single-use plastics is a crucial goal and we agree that they should be reserved for only when strictly necessary. But it's hugely important that we are all able to tell the difference between single-use applications which focus on individual portions and can often be sustainable like bottled water and single-serve applications which are used for one-time tasks and are just disposed of like plastic straws. So in regions that lack clean water access, single-use plastics actually provide proper hydration by supplying clean fresh water which stops diseases and things like that, which is essential for people's survival. Yeah, and our commitment to using prevented ocean plastic highlights a sustainable approach to our plastic usage. Yeah, for example, the commitment that you've just mentioned in our supply chain has diverted around 50 million plastic bottles, which is making a difference in these vulnerable areas. So Earth Day's third goal is to demand policies to end fast fashion and the vast amount of plastic it produces and uses. We agree people need to change how they purchase clothing for a more sustainable future, and we can do this by doing things like purchasing secondhand clothing or partaking in clothing swaps. Yeah, or investing in quality pieces that last longer, upcycling or simply supporting the sustainable brands that are out there. Innovation in sustainable materials and circular fashion practices can offer more realistic solutions. Yeah, so this is where plastics are good again as they can often enhance clothing durability, offer diverse design options and improve the performance of the clothes. Earth Day's fourth goal is to seek investment in innovative technologies and materials to build a plastic-free world. And we agree that when plastics are used irresponsibly, they can cause serious harm to the environment. Yeah, but recent studies have shown that when managed responsibly, plastics can actually have a lower environmental impact over other materials such as glass or aluminium. And we know this because we've got the scientific evidence to back it up through life cycle analysis, which considers the entire life cycle of material and not just the end of its life. Yeah, so instead of saying goodbye to plastics forever, we think there is much more we can do to live with this indispensable material. Everyone needs to play their part and make better choices. Consumers, brands, politicians and us as manufacturers, we can all make a difference. Yeah, we're all consumers and we all need to take responsibility for our own actions. So for example, just don't litter and put things in the right bins. Maybe the government could introduce deposit return schemes to increase recycling rates. Or improve our curbside collection systems. Maybe ring fence the plastic packaging tax to invest more into our recycling infrastructure. Yeah, and manufacturers like us at Spectra need to lead by example and support our customers in taking a more sustainable route. So we've all got our part to play in this to help create a brighter future for our world. Thanks for watching. Happy Earth Day!